What is up guys? Jake here with our next Rival Kingdom videos and a uh, long time no see over here. Sorry about that. Uh, it's just been tough. I've, I've sort of overloaded myself and uh, this is obviously the channel that suffers and the game that suffers. Haven't got to play as much lately. You can see not much upgraded, not much changed. Uh, but everything's going good. You know, uh, One Kingdom's doing really, really well in the wars that we're doing. Uh, got some great players. Uh, you see we got one spot open. We'll probably fill that. Uh, but, you know, leveling things up. Uh, it won't be long. We'll have a few more spots available, uh, so be looking for that. Uh, one thing I want to talk about today in this video was uh, is getting your your dragon down early. Uh, that's one thing I've noticed in my attacks is that those dragon that you know fly over dragon whether you're using for, uh, Forvel or the uh, what's this new one that I just got I can't remember now. Uh, just got him. Uh, it just seems like even if they're not on uh, on like exposed troop portals where you're getting a lot of extra you know man or mana for that it's it's still important because you get that ability you know every 30 seconds you get to use that ability and i've had that be sort of the the make or break a few times uh that i can bring my dragon in uh while after after everything's sort of cleared out or just use the ability on this guy that does damage and just you know fly over i've even had to take out the stronghold at the very end there so you know most attacks you have extra time Go ahead and get it down. Take out a few surrounding those. It helps create your funnel. Uh, it helps you build up some uh, some of his abilities. And it just seems to sort of help the raid go better. So get it down early. Uh, have a plan for it. You see right there flying across. You know, that just does damage to all those buildings. And it's not a it's not a huge deal, but it does help. And so you want to you want to try to think about that uh, when you're planning your attack. I'll drop my Maulers there and Paladins and the, the Wardens right there behind them. As soon as I get a chance right here, boom, uh, I'll get a, a shield on them. That's another thing. Even if, you know, especially if it's troop uh, portal buildings that you can take out and get those extra uh, those extra manas, even if you can't, you still get the, a few extra. And maybe just like that, using that ability there, that shield, uh, you can go ahead and get it down on your, on your troops and start uh, protecting them as they move into the base. Uh, but, you know... It's just it's just good practice. It's just something that I feel like is a is pretty much no matter what attack you're using, no matter what ancient you're using, uh, you want to go ahead and get it down first and let it start doing its work here. So we'll watch this attack shape up here. Uh, should be fine here, I think. What would he got? Yep, right there. Everything goes down. Uh, this is just the last two uh, bases on this war. I thought I would use to illustrate. I haven't even looked at the bases yet, but I'm sure they'd be. You know, like I said, it doesn't really matter what the base is. Uh, there's usually a good way to utilize that. Uh, let's go on to the next one here. Um, over at Genesis, I did step down as king. Uh, obviously, I'm still going to be involved with that clan, and we're in the, we're all in the same uh, Bindle chat and all that. Uh, they they are feeder still, but it which wasn't fair to the guys. I look here is a great example. You start taking out these when you got those. Obviously, you want to do it. Um, it wasn't fair to the guys. I wasn't able definitely wasn't able to play the second account much and to have a king that you know was always uh, being attacked in wars and all that that just basically was being neglected uh, i thought i would step down and uh put, put one of the uh, lords there in charge and they're doing a great job uh they're feeling you know they're constantly filling up so be, be looking at it There's, there is uh spots that are opening up they are taking uh you know out some of the some of the less active players and uh, replacing them, so just be be watching. You know, you'll get a chance if you're if you're patient, and you uh, keep keep an eye out for spots there. On this one, uh, Dragon didn't do. I was talking and not really paying a lot of attention, and he went down pretty early. But we should be fine here. Uh, that really the only thing that that scares me on this uh, base is that uh, uh, purple wizard tower or spell tower that's up there. Uh, you know, that can really, when you're using your sort of this paladin strategy, that can really wreck your, your raid. Uh, but with it being way, that far away from the, the, ta the stronghold, shouldn't be a problem. My wardens should sit back if they'll come up in there. Uh, they'll probably walk around the base, though. Uh, right there, got a few of them on there. Should sit back and pretty much snipe uh, that stronghold down. Uh, the, mortar, or the catapult is targeting on there. If I can get... I'd like to get right there, yeah. Just drop them. I think we'll be all right here. We'll see. That, that catapult just kind of screwing me, but got quite a few troops left. I think these wardens are going to come in and save the day here. Yep, right there. Pretty lucky, but, you know, 
Oh, man. <laughs> Wasn't watching the time either. I guess we'll get to do it again because I was not paying attention when I was doing the attack there. Uh, but anyways, as I was saying, you know, everything's going good uh, in both both kingdoms. Uh, but you should really get a chance to uh, to join if you're if you're active, if you're vigilant and you're watching. Uh, there are spots open up. We're not letting guys just sort of hang out and not not really play. Uh, we are requiring you know activity. So hang in there. We'll get it. Uh, but you know this was just sort of a video I thought about because I uh, man I keep doing that. Just screwing him. Wow, I didn't mean to drop that. That was I'm noobing it up for you guys. I meant to drop, I was trying to use my uh, dragon's ability and it died right as I did it and the, uh, <laughs> I dropped a mauler. We'll see, maybe this angle will be better. I don't think so because we're going to be up there by that, uh, that wizard tower. Let's go ahead and get that guy in. We shall see. Let me go fast forward in here. Really don't like my uh, wardens going down low there. Actually, this might have worked out better. Try to protect those maulers, or those uh, wardens. Yep, right there, boom, we got it that time. we just a few seconds left, so not a bad base, but we got it taken care of uh, right there. So right, there you go, guys. Um, that's the video. Uh, try to get that dragon down early. Get those abilities built up because it will make a difference sometimes, uh, you know, in, in the outcome of your raid. Uh, the, obviously, the best use for it to create that funnel and or take out those free troop portals. Hope you guys liked the video. Until next time, Jake reminding you guys to suck less.